All right, hey guys, here we are back for hole six. Got a little bit more range on this hole. So it's a little bit longer. Gonna make sure that I have my uh, extra mile on just in case here. I, I, I don't know what the wind is. Um, however, if you don't need it, um, then you can, you know, get away with uh, QB. Well, it looks like we won't need it. So what I recommend here is that you just lay up. However, we'll be able to lay up either way. So here I'm going to use a Titan ball um, just for that extra, you know, side spin and wind, wind resistance here. So we're at about three rings or so as my landing zone. With the great ball, should not be a problem. Just going to land just a little bit more aggressive. But here you can see um, that we can safely get it over here. As I mentioned, you can do this with a QB and some more curl as well. You could probably bring a navigator uh, if you wanted to, especially with that extra curl. You'll be able to curl it harder and get it over into the center of the fairway, still where I am. Now, the way that I play the second shot kind of varies. It kind of depends on the range that I have on the club. For a Sniper 8, um, with the headwind, we're not going to be able to do, but there's a rough bump shot by those bushes that I like to do and skip it up in towards the hole. It's going to be a little bit tougher. So what we're going to do is we're just going to do a hop shot. And since we're just going to use the hop shot, we don't really need any side spin. That's, you know, yet another reason that you could probably get away with a navigator for this hole. My opponent here is even using a Marlin. Should still be enough for them. So what I'll usually do here is no spin. There you can see min, there's max. So we're gonna use somewhere in between here. And I'll usually offset my guide a little bit as well. 5.8 rings. You can see that I'm a little offset of the hole because it is going to bounce just a little bit over. 5.8 rings. <clears throat> Perfect ball. Just going to need a little bit more offset. It looks like, you know, I only used maybe like a cup and I probably should have used a full yard. You can see I missed by about a full yard. So needed just a little bit more offset than that. But there you'll see that... Uh, you know, it gives you a very good chance here. Let's just watch my opponent so you can see. Um, you know, very similar. Even with a Sniper 6, you're going to be okay. Um, you just got to have, you know, good sound ring adjustment. You can see he doesn't have quite as much ball guide as me. It's really not that big a deal. Um, you know, you just got to basically get that ball guide pointed towards the hole and then play the same amount of rings that I would. So... You don't need to touch the spin or anything. And there you can see that it you know, comes in very nice, very good speed. Gives you a very good chance for this one. So good luck, guys. And uh, I'll see you guys for hole seven coming up. <clears throat>